Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back. You guys don't know it, but I have personally been out for three days with some terrible sickness, such as uh, maybe the flu. So it's good to be back. It's a Friday afternoon. Everyone else has taken off. Um, besides me and dad, we have some stuff we have to do today, but I was so excited to be back at work because I just, I do not like laying around and I did not feel well at all. So I got back this morning and I detailed a cab. So I've got the first sense of accomplishment done of basically the week. I worked one day this week and now it's Friday. So we got our first tractor completed, fully serviced up, and can leave the shop at some point, probably not today, but one tractor done. I'm just checking up. Really the only people working this week was Brody and Dad and Randy, and Brody cleaned this thing up. He said it was a mess. With uh, bean residue on the wheels, he had to do a lot of scrubbing, but it looks Absolutely amazing. Look showroom clean again. Good job, Brody. Good job. So what we got to do today, me and dad are going to go on a little road trip in this thing. Um, pick up something for the wash bay. Brody's been going nuts because I told him me and him were supposed to go do this right before I got sick. And then it just turned out it wasn't going to work. So me and dad are going to go today and uh, Brody's been texting, what are you getting me? What are you getting me? And I won't tell him. I think he, I think he knows, but yet he doesn't. So I'm gonna get this out, Dad. I don't know where he went. I know we're hauling some soybeans out, so I think he might be down by the bend site. I was truly concerned that you had gotten lost you know, it just never amazes me how a person can get, uh, you talk about things, you think you understand them, and hear the other person hears something totally different. <laughs> uh, I was under the understanding he had to go get some checks that we had to drop at the local elevator, and we were going to drop them off here. He went to town, dropped them off, and I've been sitting here like, man, I wonder where he could have gone. Waiting for an hour. I didn't know where you went. I finally called him. Where have you gone? I went to <laughs> what town. Do you, what do like you mean? I'm on the way I back. I told you. I told you. <laughs> I was going to go get him from Amy and then take him there and come back. And you thought I was going to get them from Amy, come back here, and then we were going. Well, I never said that. <laughs> okay, well, I'm ready. Are you driving? I don't think so, am I? I don't know. I can't handle nothing this big. But yet you drive a high-speed planter. I'll be in the back seat. <laughs> Here, you chauffeur me. Oh, what is this now? Brody. Yeah, we got to figure out how to get a Midland in here. He's been temping stuff. Hello. <laughs> you really need one of them in here, huh? Oh yes, I gotta be in communications at all times. Hmm. Just lay it down where you found it. Well, I'll stand on it though. I don't. I don't know. I think that's. Well, it'll be nice, but I don't. Isn't necessary? Maybe. Here, you guys hold that. <laughs> Look at that lake. Not even froze over. Most of it's open. Can you believe that? No ice fishing for the ice fishermen. How are you enjoying your road trip so far? Fine dined at the world famous McDonald's. Yeah, cheaper than ever now. <laughs> it costs as much as a 23 local bucks for two people. It's ridiculous. But <laughs> Dougo even ordered off the dollar menu. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> There's no inf inflation. Food is cheaper than ever. Oh my. That's what they say. <laughs> 
In <laughs> one mile, turn right onto County Road 184. Facebook Marketplace is taking us on an adventure. Oh man, I suppose that's... I did tell you that, right? When this the is, day they this disappeared. Isn't, this isn't a dealership. <laughs> you can always tell when the little highway that uh, was abandoned because the freeway came in and uh, then you uh, get off to the side track and now the gravel road. Look at this thing. This is a one laner. It's washboard. It's so bad. <laughs> uh, You're never seen again. And I never got mud flaps on the pickup so we're getting her dirty. It is what it is. We have found the interstate, only we're on the wrong side of the fence. Yeah. Can you hey, imagine? We could go get you some saddles. The saddle shop. Trying to cut back. <laughs> no. Can you imagine having life the way you think it's supposed to be or it's ordinary, average, and then the interstate comes through and no access. All of a sudden you can't get to the north. You can't get to the south. That guy back there, how far back to the south does he have to go? to get around this thing. I'd be cutting that fence, putting a little <laughs> path through there and up and over. They'd never know, right? Well, now we're gonna cross it. See, they don't have to go very far. I don't know. Do we gotta go under it? Oh yeah, we're going under. Why didn't we come in on Turn this right highway? Turn County Road 184. Yeah, GPS. <laughs> Why did we just take two miles of gravel? This is, there's a highway here. Must have it set up on shortest route instead of pavement. Well, that's a nice color of the overpass. Haven't seen that before. In three quarters of a mile, turn right. Swimming pool blue. We're in the residential area now. Yeah, that makes sense. Selling <laughs> forklifts and stuff out of the out of your house. Oh gosh, look out! <laughs> this is definitely uh, definitely a shade tree type of situation. No signs. He's got to get into promotion. <laughs> Promote your business. Put a sign up. <laughs> We're back. Let's go to the next place. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. It didn't go well. I don't know. It was okay. I didn't like how that the thing wouldn't work. Well, well you that. get the brake cleaner out, you squirt in that there thing, and then it starts working. Okay. I thought it was. So all... we're gonna go to the actual forklift place now <laughs> <laughs> and spend more money. Uh, but at least it works. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's fine. We'll never. You'll never know until we're to the next place. Maybe we'll say, oh yeah, we gotta go back to this place. <laughs> Which, yeah. We'll find out. It's kind of like the way I, it's, he maybe had the luck I had. Try to sell, to sell and something and then, oh, and it's that's worked what worked? Fine forever. And the minute the guy shows up to buy it or look at it, it's like, well, how come that ain't working? My gosh, look at Santa Claus's yard there. Wow. Okay, find me some GPS, Doug. I know where I'm going. <clears throat> take a left up here and then take a right and go across the interstate and take another left. And we're, we're right there. This looks a little bit more promising. Yeah, it's big stuff. Man, we should have brought a big, bigger trailer. How about a lull? Where's the sales department around here? Well, it used to be over to the left there. I don't know how do you get there. Uh, we're lost. Well, we just found the proper entrance here. Look at all the cool stuff. Not exactly what I thought we were coming for, but uh, <laughs> we get, we aren't going home with an empty trailer, are we? It's, uh, it's no, we got something. <laughs> I'll let you do that fancy thing and I'll do this. It came unhooked on the other side. Okay. Party happening Yeah, there's more people showing up here. Why are we leaving? The party's just starting.
Oh, I've always wanted one of these. Yep. It's going to be a lot Lock better the than pallet. the pallet. Yeah. yeah. That'll keep us safe for forklifting at high altitudes. We, uh, we the did. The bland X that we had covering the top of the pallet was getting a little little weathered, so. <laughs> So we did we did get a we did get a scissor lift for Brody. Unfortunately it's not ready to be brought home today. So we still are not gonna tell Brody and we're gonna tell him we got nothing. Don't oh, no slip of the lips. That's them them guys too. And hopefully it <clears throat> beats it to the farm before this video is out. Right. And and if you're ever up in Sox Center, Minnesota, go check them out. They've got they got a lot Unbelievable of amount of lifts. And you if you can't find one here, then... You're too fussy, then. <laughs> that is, that's true. <clears throat> well, we should get home right at the time of darkness, and the deer yeah. will be bouncing off Sun of everything. shining right in our eyes. The guy's like, you want us to deliver this basket when we deliver the lift? And I said, I pulled a trailer all the way here. I got to come home with something on it. To now we, feel fulfilled. We should call that other guy and say, sorry, we... I suppose I should that plan B. text him and tell him that it's not going to work out. Yeah. Well, show him again. The front of the building, that is. You got to You gotta see it to believe it. <laughs> Shameless plug. I know, I'm so <laughs> terrible. Uh, oh, yeah. Well, we made it home. Brody's been texting. What'd you get? What'd we get? And I sent him a photo of this. And he said, what? I thought we were getting a man lift. I just said, no. No, Brody, we, this is what I was going to get. What are you talking about? <laughs> Boy, is he going to be in for a surprise. There's oh, a japers. That would have been bad. I'd have forgot all I about that. I just told him how Brody's texting, wondering about <laughs> what we got him. Well. <laughs> It's <laughs> <laughs> gonna be funny stuff. He's just—he's uh, got to be the funnest guy to prank. I don't know about that. I don't, nobody likes a prank. I can—I only can imagine his disappointment he's feeling tonight. <laughs> he's thinking, God, I don't have to be on a ladder anymore, risking my life watching right, equipment. No, no. Oh, gotta be on that ladder again. Yeah. Look at here. <laughs> yeah, I've seen this. So this is going to be more than likely one of the biggest heartaches that I've experienced in a long time. We're going to try it out because it was on sale for a hundred dollar discount. It's got the mopping, it's got the mopping mode, mopping option. <laughs> Look at this. Can you about imagine how good this is going to work? Huh? What are you going to, that's Martin 3.0 or what? I'm going to just assume it'll be Martin junk pile. Where's the mop? Do you see a mop? This, do they call this a mop? Yeah, there's that's the... A, that's no mop. <laughs> this is not going to work. Well, so if anybody would Are like to come over and mop the office <laughs> because of the gravel... That that's what you thought was good... <laughs> 300 bucks, so whatever. Whatever? Well, you put water in it? It's got a whole stand that fills <laughs> itself up. It goes back and dumps itself out. You know, so it was on the internet. It's got to be true. Right? <laughs> well, yeah. Do you know what our shop office looks like? Yeah, I do. That's why I thought a nightly cleaning would be easier kept up with than a two week cleaning of when you bring the scoop shovel in there and in the big shop room, but we'll see. There, go back in there. Be ready to work when I ask you to. Here's is this, all this? Is this his home? That's home base. You want me to actually tear all this out, huh? It's, it's a big, it's a big base. It's a big compartment that's not coming out. <laughs> okay, we got to go home because the girls I, are... I, I cannot believe that you <clears throat> fell for something like that. What do you mean? It's on the internet. It works. <laughs> Have you never owned one of those before? Amy just got one. It's loud. You got to leave the house when it's running. <laughs> but it don't have the mop. 
so this one, I can't imagine how great this is going to be. Okay, well. <laughs> Stay tuned. Make sure to subscribe and thumbs up so here, that. We should turn yeah, it look loose. At, <laughs> we should turn it loose right here, right now. Yeah, that, that's going to work awesome. I wonder if it knows when it's full. Does it go back right away? Because I'm sure after it went It's kind of like a rock picker. It just stops, dumps wherever it's at. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, where's the little trailer that goes behind there then? We need a slurry tank that hooks on. Uh, What's this package? Ooh, that's mine. Ooh, I shouldn't... Don't look at that. Why? Well... By Christmas? That's the small package. That's the trailer? The slurry tank? For it? it goes on a trailer. Mm. More, more interesting stuff for you guys to subscribe and watch as he disagrees on things that I'm going to do. You didn't have this in the... Yeah. yeah. You never said nothing. No. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned because we got a lot of exciting stuff coming here. If we can ever get over our sicknesses and actually get back to work. I'm looking forward to it, actually. Work? Yeah. Getting back to it, right? Laying in the basement Shivering. for the last three days is Shivering. about the worst thing. Yeah. You know, you always, you, you always you always think about how nice a day would be to have off. And then when you lay in the basement shivering, you just wish you could go back to work so badly. That's what I've experienced the last few days. Northern trip. If I drank more than that, I wouldn't have gotten the flu. Oh, it is mine. See my name on there? It's mine. So you guys stay hydrated.